We're going to start this puppy up. Clear? Prop? And welcome back to Tip of the Week. There's only about a week left before we get back to building on the Affordaplane project. In the meantime, I thought it would be nice to share a little bit about my flying background. And I have a short video. Let me first say that I started my flying career about 20 some years ago with ultralights. I started with a Challenger and then a Kolb Firestar. And then I went for my full-blown private pilot's license. There, of course, I trained on Cessnas, things like that. The film I'm going to show you is when I decided to build a kit, small kit, experimental aircraft. It's a Zenith 701. And the reason I'm showing you this is this aircraft is so similar in flying characteristics to ultralights that I want you to take note that this might be a good transition vehicle for learning to fly an ultralight. So let's take a look at the very first kit, experimental kit I built. Now this is again about 20 years ago, so uh, the dollar value has changed and the price of getting your license has changed. But the point is that I want you to watch the takeoff and landing of this vehicle. And I wanna let you know that it is so much closer to the way an ultralight flies compared to any Cessna or any other heavy, small aircraft like that. So let's take a look. No, it's a perfect day for it. I probably prefer that east to west runway. It's actually a little smoother now that Jerry bought that other piece and extended a little bit.
outside or anything, but I gotta watch it. And there you have it. Now, I promise next week we will get back to the Affordaplane project. I promise. Of course, that and a quarter will get you a cup of coffee, but I will do my best. We need to get back to building and get that project moving. But keep in mind that transition training into flying ultralights is very important. And if you have a friend that, have, that has one of these zeniths, they, especially the 701, they are very close to learning how to fly an ultralight, learning how it lands and takes off because they go slow. And that's the best way, the most fun when it comes to flying.